Good day everyone, my name is Erika Loriano Nefreka and for today's video, I will identify if the given graph can be one-to-one -one function or not. Letter A is one-to-one -one function because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Letter B is one-to-one -one function. It is the same answer in letter A. Because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Letter C, not one-to-one -one function. Because it intersects the graph of the function at two points. Letter D, not one-to-one -one function. Same reason to letter C. Because it intersect the graph of the function at two points. Letter E. One to one function. Same reason to letter A. Because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Good day everyone, and this is my performance in general mathematics. And for today's video, I will identify if the given graph can be one-to-one -one function or not. Letter A is one-to-one -one function because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Letter B is one-to-one -one function. It is the same reason to letter A, because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Letter C is not one-to-one -one function, because it intersects the graph of the function at two points. Letter D is not one-to-one -one function, same reason to letter C, because it intersects the graph of the function at two points. Letter E is one-to-one -one function. It is also the same with the letter A, because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Hello everyone, it's me again, Julianne. I'm Maxipo, and for today's video, I will explain my answer in written work number 7 and subject general mathematics. Letter A answer is one-to-one -one function because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal life of most time. Letter B answer one-to-one -one function, same reason to letter A because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal life of most ones. Letter C answer is not one-to-one -one function because it intersects the graph of the function at two points. Letter D answer not one-to-one -one function, same reason to letter C because it intersects the graph of the function at two points. Letter E answer one-to-one -one function, same reason to letter A because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal life of most ones. That's all and thank you for watching my video. Okay, one-to-one -one function because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Letter B. One-to-one -one function, it is the same answer in letter A because any horizontal line will intersect a diagonal line of most ones. Letter C, not one-to-one -one function because it intersect the graph of the function at two points. Letter D, not one-to-one -one function, same reason to letter C because it intersect the graph of the function at two points. Letter E, one-to-one -one function. Same reason to letter A, because any horizontal line intersect a diagonal line of most ones.